one of the student doctors at the clinic. So today I've been asked to perform a lower limb examination on you. Um, but just before I get started, I just wanted to make sure I was talking to the right patient. Mm -hmm. So if I could just get your full name. Yep, Ruth Liu. Yeah, and uh, what was your date of birth? Uh, 25th of July, 1999. Mm. And your occupation? Student. And were you of Aboriginal or Torres Strait Islander origin? Mm. No, okay. Um, so nice to meet you, Ruth. Um, like I said, a lower li limb examination today. So that'll just involve me having a look, having a feel, um, getting you to do a few movements, and I'll also be doing a few of those movements, as well as a few special tests mm -hmm. on your lower limbs, so hip, knees, ankles. Um, in order to do this examination, it will require exposure of the area that I'm looking at, um, but for today, just shorts is fine as well. Um, does that sound all okay with you? Yeah. Yep. Great. And I just wanted to assure you that everything that's done in this consultation will remain strictly confidential between you, me, and the treating medical team. Yep. But without further ado, we'll get started. Yep. So having a look at your feet, um, so at rest I don't notice any um, obvious deformities with your feet. If you could just walk backwards and forwards for me. Great, so your gait seemed to be normal. Um, there wasn't any flat foot deformity at all or any other deformities such as any hallux valgus or nodules. Um, and I didn't notice any calf wasting either. If you could just show me the bases of your feet. And then the other one. Yeah, so there seems to be some calluses at the bases of your great toes, um, but that's quite normal. Um, and overall, there wasn't any obvious swelling, um, there isn't any crowding of the toes, and there isn't any um, skin or nail changes either. I'll move on to now having a feel of your feet, if that's okay, specifically the ankle. Are you currently in any pain or discomfort? No, okay. So I'll feel for the medial malleolus, no pain. Mm -hmm. And the lateral malleolus, feel for the Achilles tendon, make insertion onto the calcaneus, and then any pain at all at the bases? No. Okay. I'll just feel along your, um, I guess, tarsals and metatarsals. Any pain at all? Neither on this side. Mm. Yeah. And how about these joints here? So this one here. So the proximal. Uh, metatarsophalangeal and then distal ones. Any pain at all? Mm -hmm. No. Okay. So um, I didn't feel any obvious um, swelling or there didn't seem to be any tenderness for Ruth. Um, I didn't notice any effusion of any areas or joints um, and the temperature on both seemed normal as well. So it seems all good. So um, I'll just get you to do a few movements for me first. So first of all, if you could just um, bring both of your toes towards you as much as you can and point your toes like ballerina. Yeah. And then if you could try and make the bases of your feet point towards each other and then point away from each other. Great. Okay. Um, and after that, if you could just wriggle your toes for me. Fantastic. So it seems like you moving your toes are all normal and good. There's no reduction of the range of movement. So now I'll do that for you. So just relax. So I can confirm that um, with passive movements, all the movements of your joints in your foot and the ankle seem normal as well. So now I'll just test for the integrity of your Achilles tendon. So if I can just get you to shift onto your tummy. Great. Um, and I'll just bend your knee to 90 degrees. If you could just relax, I'm just going to squeeze on your calf. Yeah, so I can see your foot uh, plantar flexing. So Seems like the Achilles tendon is intact with your left foot. And then the other one. Yeah, so that plantar flexes as well. Great, so feel free to lie back down if you're back. Um, the Achilles tendons of both of your ankles seem to be all normal. So those were all the examinations I wanted to do today. If there were any abnormalities, I would also uh, order some x-rays or some ultrasounds or some MRIs. Um, but it seems like everything's normal, which is good. Um, I would also assess for your neurovascularity, so sensations and pulses, but we won't be doing that today. So thank you so much for your time. I'll pass on all of my findings onto your doctor.